Roe v. Wade got turned over yesterday and I'm gonna speak my mind on this. I will be posting it to my YouTube channel, but I, with what I've been through in my life, with the men that I've met and the men in my life that I've either had, I'm family with or I have dated or anything in that perspective that treated me badly. My brothers, I don't count my brothers. My brothers are amazing. They keep me safe. I love them dearly. I just... I need to say that this is bullshit. For 50 years, Roe v. Wade was to protect women's rights and to keep women to have health care, to have uh, health care, medicine, Medicaid, to keep abort, to not keep the abortion, sorry. I've been out of it and I was, I'm on a new medication, so God, give me a minute. To uh, not have a baby, so basically, go uh, not against the abortion, you know what I mean on that, but, I'm just gonna flat out say it, America isn't safe anymore, America is not safe anymore, and it's not only women's rights that are being drawn away it's everybody in between so that's like the lesbians the transgenders the the every every everybody I am actually very upset I actually am for women and for women's rights even though I don't identify as a woman anymore. I may have the body of a female, but I don't ad identify as a woman anymore. This is just sickening because I have a IUD, which prevents pregnancies. And now that I won't be able to have that privilege to renew it in five years. I am not going to force myself to have a child. When in my mental capacity, I cannot even have a child. I love children. I have two half siblings. I love them a lot. They mean everything to me. You cannot force me to do something that I don't want to do. You can have free reign with your guns and everything, but you keep your laws off my body. You don't have rights to my body when it's my choice. Sorry if it's shaking. I'm just... Everything that's been going on, I feel like I need to speak it out. If women are afraid, if women are scared, if women need to seek like a, a safe, space, safe space, I'm here for you. Subscribe to me. DM me. I have social medias you can add me on. I have social medias you can DM me on. I have many of platforms you can connect with me on. I am pro-women. I'm not pro-life, I'm pro-women. Women deserve to have their rights. And just because someone who is age enough to have their period, to have a baby, that is disgusting. I have, I am living with three young cousins. All three of them go through menstrual. And if you dare touch 
touch any of my cousins I've been living with? Oh. You will not, you will not want, you will not want it. Now with the supremacy and the women in the supremacy, the women who, I won't even consider a woman anymore. She has no right to say what she wants anymore. Her husband gets to tell her what she gets to do. And it's more sad because if women get miscarriages, they go to jail for murdering the baby when it was a body and not her. And now, I have an IUD, so I don't even know if I'm going to be able, you know, to do any of that. This, like, women need to be on a lookout. Like, like I say, if subscribe to me, we could DM each other, we could talk to each other. I, I like, I don't care. But it's my body, my choice, and I am not going to have children. And like I say, and I will always say with my mental capacity, I cannot have children. With the way that I grew up, with the way that my parents were all the time, I am not going to go in their footsteps. Thank you very much. I am not going to put my child's life on the line. Okay, let me tell you this. Uh going to be very open with you on this and if my brothers do stumble upon my video I'm sorry you're gonna have to hear the truth on this but when me and my two older brothers were younger we were younger my dad wanted to unlive himself while my mom was out getting drugs and alcohol while we were all in the living room watching TV or playing video games, my dad would lock himself in the bathroom, trying to unlive himself. This is very hard for me to say. My dad has gone through so much bullcrap in his life, I don't blame him. Now, he wasn't a really good father towards me. Now, I never really had a father figure, so I... I grew more into being like a male. So, I protect my women. I've been bisexual since 15. 15. And you know, I've always wanted to have children, but with how America is right now, it's no. There's no way my child will survive. And with all the TikToks I keep seeing, and with all the people spewing out their stuff like that. I don't want- if I get one male comment on this video, I will delete the video, or not delete the video, delete the comment and block you. Unless if you're an actual man and who actually cares about women's rights, please subscribe and please comment. This is a very serious situation that's going to affect women's lives and it's going to affect everybody in between. Now, did you know when a male ejaculates, he actually kills babies? So wouldn't that be genocide? Why are we going like, hear me out. Every time a male ejaculates, every time he ejac ejaculates, 3,000 children die. But yet, we, uh, the women are getting prone to not have rights to their bodies. Women, you have all right to your body. Even teenage girls, you have all right to your body. I, I'm pro-women. Pro women will always be my thing. But I ain't gonna let no 
supremacy white man Trump supporter. I don't sub don't support Trump. I kind of support Biden, but not that much. America is going back in reverse. It's like we're going back to the 40, 40s and 50s again, where women will always have to cook for their for their uh, husbands. Husbands don't get to do anything except for work. Women were losing our rights. I'm still going to be going the job to my work. Trust me. You ain't going to stop me from getting paid because as a non-female I deserve to have a job. And every female that is afraid to keep going at what their their passions or their dreams are, don't stop. We need to show them that we're stronger. And I do plan on someday in the future having male genitals because been on my mind for months and months probably three to four years now like I said my body my choice I ain't gonna let no old white man or lady walk all over me I just want to know why America is going backwards and not forwards like next they're gonna get rid of same-sex marriage the LBGTQ community, which I am a part of, heavily a part of. Just because women don't want to do things with men doesn't mean that you have to overrule our own bodies. Men should, all men should be getting a vasectomies right now. So then women will feel happier having, you know, sex with men. I don't support non... I don't support people that don't support women. So, if you do not support women, you need to unsubscribe to me right now. But if you do support women, you can subscribe to me and comment on this video and share it to all platforms. I really don't care. Get this message out. Women, we need you need to be stronger and I'll be there with you. I'll be your per supreme leader on keeping you going and keeping you happy and keeping you pushing forward. I know your rights are taken away. Trust me. Half of my rights are taken away. But I'm not going to let that stop me from going to my job or stop me from doing the things that I like. But I just think every state, we should all, all states. We, we need to start a rally to keep women's rights because women deserve to have rights. If the woman is raped and doesn't want to have the baby and now she has to have it in her body, even if the baby is dead in her body, she still has to carry it for full term. That's sickening. That's very sickening. Everybody's lives are at cost. And once they overrule for same-sex marriage and uh, transgender people, they're already attacking the transgender youth, they're going to attack us next. We need to be strong. We need to be strong. Please subscribe to me. We need to get this around the earth. 
I don't care how long it takes. I don't care who you send it to. I don't care who likes or subscribes to me for that matter. We need to get this out. Pe women need to be stronger. We need to be stronger. I know I keep saying we. Like I said, I have half of my rights taken away. I'm non-binary. I may have female parts, but I don't identify as a female. But we need to be strong. And I know we could be strong. But please, pro women only can be subscribed to my channel. Pro women, like, I don't even care about the pro life anymore. It's pro women, pro LBGP, LBGTQ, pro all of that. I support all of that. So, please consider subscribing. I know it's a long rant, but I had to say it.